Hello, and welcome to our LandGlide video FAQ for how to use the measurement tool. This video will cover how to measure distance, area, and perimeter in the LandGlide mobile application. We will start by measuring distance. Once you have the desired parcel on the screen and are ready to measure, tap the map icon on the right side of the map. Then tap the measure icon, which looks like a crossed pencil and ruler. You will know the measurement tool is open because you will see it displayed at the bottom of the map area. Now line the crosshairs up with the starting point for your measurement. Tap the point drop icon, which looks like a balloon and is located on the right side of the measurement display, to drop your starting point. Next, line the crosshairs up with your second point and hit the point drop icon again. In the measurement display at the bottom of the screen, you'll now see the distance between the two points. By clicking on the measurement icon on the left side of the measurement display, you can change the unit of measurement. If you choose automatic, the unit of measurement will automatically adjust based on the size of the area being measured. Tapping and holding on the displayed value will copy it to the clipboard. Now that we've mastered distance, let's move on to measuring area and perimeter. Once you have the measurement tool open, we will start our area measurement the same way we started our distance measurement. Line your crosshairs up with the starting point of your perimeter and tap the point drop icon. Then, line up the second point of your perimeter and hit the point drop icon again. We'll repeat this process. Line up the corner and tap the point drop icon. If you misplace a point, just hit the undo icon which looks like an arrow and is located next to the point drop icon. You'll see the last point placed disappear, and you can now place the point in the correct spot. Once at least three points have been dropped, here we did four. You can click area in the measurement display at the bottom of the screen to display the area and perimeter of the outline shape. Just like before, you can change the unit of measurement by clicking the measurement icon and choosing automatic will automatically adjust the units based on the size of the area being measured. Also like before, you can copy the measurement information by tapping and holding on the displayed values. When you have finished your measurement, you can click start over to delete all measurements taken and begin another measurement, or you can click the red arrow at the top of the screen to exit the measurement tool completely and continue using LandGlide. We hope this tutorial was helpful. Please feel free to reach out to us with any questions. Thank you for using LandGlide, and happy measuring!